Hundreds injured in clashes in Spain as police try to prevent voting in Catalonia's independence referendum. Police were using batons and fired rubber bullets at angry voters who were trying to enter the polling stations. Catalan officials say over 400 people are being treated for injuries due to police action. Spain's deputy prime minister says police acted with professionalism and in a proportionate way. In Girona, riot police smashed their way into a polling station where Catalan's leader was due to vote. Carlos Puigdemont has accused Spain of unjustified violence, but some avoided clashing with police and were able to vote. The referendum has been declared illegal by the country's central government. Pressure for the vote among Catalonia has grown over the past few years. The wealthy region of 7.5 million people has its own language and culture. It also has a high degree of autonomy, but it's not recognized as a separate nation. Carlos Puigdemont originally said that if the yes vote wins, the Catalan government would declare independence within 48 hours. But even if that happens, the ballot will have no legal status, as it's been blocked by the constitutional court. It's Madrid that has the ultimate power. Under its 1978 charter, it can suspend the regional government's authority to rule if it declares independence.